Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. I'm Carmen. And I'm Cassie. We are doing a video that was requested by one of our lovely subscribers. So we've got a $10,000 bag challenge that we'll be doing in this video. So basically how the tag works is you have $10,000 to spend on bags for the rest of your life. So you've only got $10,000 to spend and once you reach that quota, you cannot buy any more bags. So what bags would you buy up to $10,000 to last you for the rest of your life? And I guess we'll explain why we chose what we have on our list. And we actually both don't know what we no. each chose either. So this will be interesting to know if, if we, we have the same taste or if we've got something different on our minds um, and also just to mention we are doing this in Australian dollars I think um, other people in other countries like the US um, also did $10,000 US but um, obviously Australian dollars is quite low at the moment so you can't really <laughs> get a lot with it um, <laughs> um, but yeah if if you'd like to know what we'd choose for 10,000 Australian dollars, then please keep watching. Okay, so I guess we'll start off. <laughs> Alright, so for my first bag, well, if I only had $10,000 to spend, my thoughts were I want a Chanel bag in my collection. Mm -hmm. And obviously, I cannot afford a classic flap. Well, I can't. I can, <laughs> but then I won't be able to get anything else. Yeah. So, the classic my... flap in Australia is literally like $8,900. So, <laughs> there's not a lot to spend afterwards. <laughs> no. So, for my Chanel bag, what I chosen was the Square Mini. I chose that one too! Is that your most expensive one? Yeah. Yes. Okay, so both of us chose <laughs> Chanel Square Mini, um, and that's currently retailing for $4,560 yep. on yep. the Chanel website, so that's literally half of our budget gone. <laughs> but, um, the that was my thought Why, why did you well? choose it? Because, like you said, I would like to have a Chanel bag yep. in my collection mm -hmm. too, if I only had $10,000 yep. to spend, um, and obviously I can't buy anything, anything else. else. Um, I thought about putting the wok in, but then mm. I was like, I had the wok and I sold mm. it, so I don't think I should have it in my collection. So what square yeah. mini would you want? Like, I, caviar? So, yep. I definitely want caviar, mm. and for those who don't know, I do have the chevron pattern um, mm. in the black with the silver hardware, so if I were to have a Chanel mini square, that's a yeah, combination that, was, that I that would That was get. my one as yeah. well. And the reason why is you can wear that to like dinners, you can mm. wear that casually, you can yeah. wear that to anything. Yeah. So. I thought about the quilted version mm. of the gold hardware, mm. but I was like, mm, nah, because I think definitely, like you said, the chevron mm. and the silver hardware is a little bit more versatile mm. and you can wear that casually. So. Oh, we got the yeah. same one! So that's half our budget going. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, what's your next bag? Okay. Here you go, your next one. Alright, so okay. the next one that I have had on my list. No picking. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, Go, this one, second most expensive one. Second one, okay. Yeah. Alright, so we do it in that. Yeah, do it in. Um, okay, so this one I contemplated for a while. Okay. I was like, I don't love it, but I think I should have it. Okay. So, I wanted the LV Neverfull. That was so <laughs> And I did it because I love it though. That so was mine. I, I oh thought, my God. Okay. Because um, the rest of my bag, sneak peek, um, mm. are all quite small bags. So I thought if I were to only have one tote, then the LV Neverfull would be probably the best choice. And also the Neverfull now comes with the extra pouch. pouch. So yeah. you can use that for other things as well. So it's kind of like a two-in-one. But So that Neverfull at the moment is $2,100. Mm -hmm. Australian. Mm. But yeah, I chose the Neverfull as well, but that's because yeah. at the moment in my bag collection, that's my most used bag. Yeah. And I yeah. literally use it everywhere. Yeah. So, Let me get it. <laughs> um, I love my Neverfull and I definitely I would want choose it, it yes. in this combination. And this exact one yeah. as well. Yeah. yeah. Perfect. Okay. Oh my I god. All right. the same one. <laughs> Let's see if our other ones are similar. All right. Okay. Your turn next. <laughs> okay. So, I've got two more. Mm -hmm. um, my next one is I wanted a more casual bag. Yeah. Um, I have a feeling this is going to be the same one <laughs> that I can use on holidays. <laughs> oh, <laughs> it's coming! <laughs> it's the Gucci style. <laughs> Yeah, I, yeah, yeah. Well, I mean, because Cassie, I have one in the black, black, and 
and I have it in the beige. But so. I wanted this one in the beige because yeah. um, according to all my other bags, I wanted something that I could wear every with everything really. Yeah. And I quite like the beige one, so yeah. I chose the yeah. beige one. <laughs> okay. Three out of three. But why guys? did you choose your Soho? Is it the same reason? Like Yeah, the well I I own the mm. beige version and mm. I love it and I always take it with me on holidays. Mm. So that was yeah, my mine was a holiday. Yeah. Too, because I would like to have a travel bag and yeah. the Gucci Soho Disco is the one that I always take. Okay, last how many I can't bags? believe we how have a bag do you have? I have one more, I okay, think. Okay, okay. What's your last one? Yes, I have okay, one more. Okay, what's your last bag? Okay, so, um, I don't actually have this bag. Okay. But I have wanted it for a long time. Mm -hmm. And I thought everything else has been ticked off and I don't have an evening oh bag. Oh my god, I so... think I'm the same. Okay, <laughs> keep going. Which one is it though? So, I wanted to get the same one. <laughs> <laughs> The wrong envelope clutch. But is yours the wallet on the chamber envelope? So, um, I can't afford the bigger version, which is actually the one that um, I want to get. Um, we'll leave a little picture yeah. on the screen. Yeah. But, um, so I thought I will get the smaller version, which is the one that you have, which is, um, yeah. it, it's a wallet on a chain, wallet essentially. Chain it looks the same, but yeah. it's just slightly smaller. Yeah. Um, that, and oh my god, we literally yeah. picked the same list. I like, we're not, we're not, we're not thing. lying, like, literally. <laughs> <laughs> we did not tell each other what let, we let, this this is if you Mine can read well. that on the screen I, I don't think that uh, I don't know anyway <laughs> but literally it's definitely definitely no, the same but the thing is okay so so I was actually over budget yeah $65 sorry, $65 yeah. but I had a look on the Nordstrom website <laughs> And it's re so on the Wildstar website, it's retailing for eighteen thousand eighteen hundred and eighty. Yeah, that's but what on I have. But Nordstrom is thirteen fifty. Oh, so wait, really? Yes, I need to get on there. It's thirteen fifty, but what that's color? only the black one though. Um, but I want one in the um, I want one in the yeah, the part color. yeah. So that's the thing as well. Like mm -hmm. I was thinking, obviously, this is all original. Um, recommended retail pricing mm. that we've used but there are so many websites that sell different bags these days and promo codes that you mm. can use so you can definitely get it under ten thousand dollars but we're just trying to stick to the rules as much as we can <laughs> but then I was thinking all right so if this bag was 1350 I still got five hundred dollars <laughs> would you buy a wallet wouldn't you no no, no 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 really? no 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 because it's a what bag so I'll uh, buy the mini pochette as a swap uh, and then I can use that as a crossbody bag yeah, as well. And also me. Yeah. yeah. So that was my idea. that was my list. Okay, yeah. yeah. Well in that case <laughs> I would get a drink. <laughs> <laughs> we technically we both chose exact. I can't believe we actually we, chose You know the same what? One. We can just share the bags, and then we've got another ten thousand yes. dollars to spend, and we can buy the classic oh my flat. God. Yes, <laughs> good idea. <laughs> and that's like what nine thousand dollars. Yeah, yeah. then we got a thousand dollars to spend on something else. But hmm. what will we get? Well, we can get your Saint Laurent bag because if we True. buy that for thirteen fifty, yeah. we still got. Yeah. A bit of money. But anyway, <laughs> anyway, <laughs> we got, that was fun. Uh, that was really fun. I can't believe we chose the same one. Yeah. Well, we obviously have, have similar taste. very similar taste, um, hence why in our bag collection, um, we'll leave that in the description box as well, actually, yeah. um, we did mention that we a have lot of the bags, bags, we have the same ones. So, yeah, yeah um, we hope you enjoyed this video. <laughs> what would you guys do or spend your $10,000 on? Let us know in the comments below because, um, yeah, we'd like to know what everyone else would spend their money on. Ours is, ours is very yeah. sad. It's the same. <laughs> you can see what Phoebe's is. Yeah. Uh, we should get Phoebe to do it on her we'll after. Yeah. yeah. But, yeah, thank you for watching. Uh, if there's any other challenges or tags uh, in regards to bags, then let us know because that we had so much fun. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, and we'll see you in our next video. Bye!